The film with the most Golden Globe nominations this year. But, does it live up to its reputation? Alright guys, so, Carol. In Carol, Therese and Carol, being played by Rooney Mara and Kate Blanchett, slow, slowly start to develop a romantic relationship in the 1950s, and whilst all of this is happening, they're each having side problems with each of their men being played by Jake Lacey and Kyle Chandler. Going into this film, I hadn't really known much about it. All I knew was that it was getting a ton of awards bust, and that it started Rooney Mara and Kate Blanchett, and finally I got the chance to see it, and how was it? Well, Let's find out. Now, while I don't love this film as much as the Golden Globes does, I certainly do still think that Carol is a very good film. By far here, the best thing is the acting in this movie. Respectively, the two leads being played by Rooney Mara and Kate Blanchett do a fantastic job. Rooney Mara gives a very likable performance and you enjoy watching her character on screen. And Kate Blanchett gives an even better performance as it is very subtle, but she also, it's also brilliant at the same time. Also, they're both, like I said, they're both having problems with their side men. And then, uh, Rooney Mara's boyfriend is being played by Jake Lacey. And I thought that their relationship was very well handled. As well as Kate, as well as Kate Blanchett and Kyle Chandler, which I enjoyed out of the, uh, two relationships. I thought that was even better done. Kyle Chandler, like, knocks it out of the park in this movie. I haven't seen him in a great movie since, like, the Wolf of Wall Street, I think, and he does a fantastic job here, and overall, I like both the stories with their men, as well as the story of Carol and Therese together. Todd Haynes also does a very good job at directing this movie. He has a lot of shots that just go on for a really long time, and they look really nice, as well as he just directs it in a way that it really seems like this movie is set in the 1950s, and I thought it was really well done. I mean, that really all I can say about this movie is that it's a very well done movie, like, it's acting, it's directing, it's writing. It's just all around a very well done film. Just I have one small problem with it. The main problem with it is that there's third act and in the third act I felt like it was a lot more boring than the rest of the movie. I wasn't as invested, but I was still invested, but I wasn't as invested as I was in the first two. But overall, I really enjoyed Carol. I thought it was a very good movie. It has great direction, great writing. Great acting, definitely some of the best acting I've seen all year. So overall, Carol, uh, it was a very good movie. Overall though, I'm gonna give Carol an A-. minus. Thank you all so much for watching, and until my next review, I'm Random Mr. 401 I will see you all later.